And what type of content do you do on TikTok? We try to post different content. So if we just do thirst traps all the time, bikini pics and, you know, whatever, it, yeah, I can see the numbers just tanking. Yeah. So, you know, I tried about every three days or so do fitness uh, TikToks, whether it's her in the gym or I think um, we're going to do one tomorrow about nutritional planning or something to change the approach seems to help regenerate the the algorithm. Um, so, you know, I, so that's what we kind of do on the main one. Um, and then we'll do the thirst traps on the other ones and see what happens. But I think that one's big enough now that if we change to more of a fitness, we can start to do brand deals and those types mm -hmm. of stuff. It's tough to do brand deals with thirst traps. So yeah. that's what we're thinking. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. That's one of the other big points I try to push as well is like, you know, creating that bridge to where if you can sort of establish yourself as a mainstream influencer, you know, specifically in the fitness niche is a really good niche to get those brand deals and different affiliate partnerships and all kinds of other ways to monetize the social media aside from just OnlyFans. That's like, I'm, I don't know if you guys um, saw or look at the group uh, announcements anymore, but I'm right in the middle of like a big, big yep. course update, which is really kind of focused on that aspect of, you know, building your social media accounts in such a way that it's going to drive in a ton of, you know, fans for only fans, but also, you know, having that capability to bridge to that, you know, to those mainstream brand deals and, and stuff like that, because, you know, only fans is unpredictable and who knows what could happen with it. So having, you know, multiple streams of income from brand deals and other ways to monetize your yeah. accounts is, is going to become more important as, as we move into the future with, with only fans and it just becomes, you know, more and more saturated, more competitive and just, um, everything like that. So, yeah, I think, I think what you guys are doing is, is just fucking spot on. I think it's great. 